This guy is the six-time Monaco winner in yeah. the historic Exactly, yeah. Yeah, this is the 14th uh, historic Monaco. This is a Climax V8 engine, still one and a half litre. So what's make it, when you say Climax V8, it's obviously yeah. changed from a four yeah. cylinder. Well, that was a Climax again. Okay. They were Climax Four-time engines. Assets. They were developed as uh, water pump engines right. for the military and for the fire service to be able to pump water, to be able to pump water at a very high rate, very yeah. efficiently, and be able to be carried by two men in the field. Wow. Um, so lightweight and lots of power yeah. and durability is exactly what Dad wanted. And then they went on and developed the V8 because they started being successful in, in motor racing. What's on the dials these days? You really yeah, I mean, they've fuel, got um, oil, yeah, yeah, water. Fuel, fuel pressure, there's no actual fuel gauge as such. Right. There's no speedo, there's only a taco. Right. Um, they probably didn't want to know how quick they were going. Gauges. Taco for those again is what? Yeah, the, Rebbing, the rev counter. Rev, rev but then counter. They, they probably didn't even look at the rev counter that much because they just learnt the sound. So they knew exactly what revs they were doing from the noise. This is arguably the, the, the greatest F1 car in the world. Greatest um, It revolutionised Formula 1 car design.